The Games are almost here and the finishing touches to the Olympic Park are being put into place. Last week, the official electricity supply for the Games unveiled their new stadium side pavilion. The aim? To explain to the hundreds of thousands of visitors from all around the globe their sustainability and low carbon electricity story. Low carbon electricity is, is, is really important. How can we engage with the various publics on how electricity is, is made, where it's generated? How do you combine different generation means to make something which is a specific mix which can respond to demand? Electricity demand is, is, is growing. Obviously it's the energy of the future, like, like we, we like saying. So how can we explain in a very, I would say, educational but also entertaining way, the generation mix? 100% well done. And that entertainment is in many different forms from iPads and Android apps, to electricity generating games, and even a dance floor. All this is great fun, and the building is designed to attract people to experience electricity. But what will happen when it's gone? EDF have built this pavilion not just to be a temporary structure, but to be a lasting legacy. And they say the key to this is its sustainability. It's very sustainable. This membrane lets through uh, I would say air that's through uh, the natural light, uh, natural ventilation, is, so it's quite uh, a low carbon and low footprint building. Uh, it's really the sustainability, uh, I would say, elements were really core to how we made this building, I would say, come out of earth really and be built. So we are keen really to work with the, all the various parties who will be interested in the, the legacy uh, and keeping this building. That's for the future. Right now, for the next six weeks, the aim of the building is to teach everyone who comes into the games a bit more about electricity and how much we rely on it for this and future generations. Kristen Foden, Energy Live News, The Olympic Park. <laughs>